Let's show mom and dad. Come on. Hold on, let's pause. Muppet Queen. What are we learn? Come here, this what? is what? Show, show. You say, okay. Or you can say, look, 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 look. You go down here, say, got him. Uh -huh. Got him, like this. Look at what you're doing. See, got him. <laughs> hey. Hey. See, I didn't want to leave today. No? No. Oh. I think, I think it's because last time we didn't get ice cream like dad did. So now she doesn't want to come yeah, Don't keep blaming it. It's one day it's we went to do something it's special. Cool. When yeah. I went to get her last week, she would not get in my car. She kept pushing me yeah. to towards Dream Act. And I was like, I wonder what caused that. Listen, Missy. <laughs> And they said that she kept requesting it, and they yeah. saw that dad was taking I'm not putting it. up with this guilt trip, all right? She knows. Check it out. Okay, so I got in this awesome seed starter kit, mm -hmm. and I thought this would be a really great project for you to help with, because I was looking at it, I was like, there's so many little pieces. Look how cute little little tools are for it. So we gotta try this out. I got this for the garden and stuff, but I was like, man, this mm -hmm. is a perfect project. Okay? Come here, you ready? That piece goes on top. Like that. Cool? Maybe I should read the instructions. Okay, so I was looking for a seed starter kit because we're doing gardening stuff this year again. And I found this one, and it has all these little pieces and everything. So Abigail and I have been working on assembling them. I was like, this will be a perfect home task for Miss Abby here. I got your dirt kit up. Okay. Look at here. I think that'll work. Okay, so what we gotta do is we gotta put dirt in each one of these. No, no, that stays right here. It does. I promise you, I'm not lying. Look at there. Hold it. Okay, we can use it. That was great. Yeah, fill that thing up. You got. You also have a little scoop. See, you can scoop and fill. You want to try the scoop? Scoop it. And that's why we got this this mat. Isn't that cool? Hey, you want to scoop some? You want your hands? You can use your hands. Put your hands in it. Put it on top here. Right. Can you rip? Can you push it in? Okay. Nice. This is not the right soil for this. This is what I have. This is more like garden soil, in ground soil, not pot soil. But it's okay. It will grow. <laughs> Okay. This is the fun part. That's where this cool tool comes in. You ready for this? Here we go. We're gonna start with some hot peppers, jalapenos. Okay. I'm gonna put those over here. Like that. All right, take your tool. And then push it down in, boop, right in the middle. Push, good job, okay. Next one, look, look what you're doing. Right here, push, push, good job. I feel you pushing, nice, right here. Push, right here. Look down. Right here. Push. 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 Right here. Mm -hmm. right. I think I got one more. Ah. One more. Ah. Right here. Look what you're doing. Push. Good job. All right, we gotta drop seeds in there. Here, look. Can you pick up that tiny little seed? Look at him. Pick up, hey, pick up those tiny little seeds. Put it right here. Put it in the hole. 
You gotta put it in the hole. No. There you go. Look, pick those up. Put them right in the hole. Nice. Perfect. Look at what you're doing. Good job. I don't know if that one made it in there or not. Isn't that cool? All right, you scoop up this dirt right here. Scoop up that dirt, put it on top. Yeah. Scoop that up. Scoop it up, put it on top. Lovely, lovely. Our peppers we can start now, our tomatoes we can start now. This will go inside. All right, so I'm gonna pick up our tray. I'm gonna pick up the tray and put it in here. No, we don't wanna dump it. Okay, we're not gonna dump it. We're gonna pick it up like this and set it down in, okay? Two hands, pick it up. Mm. Nicely done. Mm. And then hold on, we have a lid. We have a, a greenhouse effect going on. Okay, take that. Goes push. Clips on there and then, yep, we have a grow light. How cool is that? This goes there. This is the first one we've assembled, so. Push. Maybe with the lid off. Yeah, there we go. How cool is that? Oh, it has labels too. We gotta put the labels in there, Abigail. Can't forget. We'll get confused. Tomatoes? Yeah. Tomatoes. All right, you wanna start filling up dirt? Come on, you start with the dirt. You can get it out of there. You can get that dirt. Keep going, fill it all the way up. Fill it all the way up. Keep going. And you got you got one filled up. Keep going. Keep going. I'm gonna make the label for the peppers. Okay. Jalapenos. Look, push this turn around. So in all the cups. Get more dirt. Keep filling it up. Keep filling it up. Look, see, you need dirt in these ones too. Move that dirt around. There you go. Take hey, it more. Move all around. Keep going. Keep going now. Move the dirt around. Oh, wow, you got a lot on there now, huh? Okay, oh, I think that's good. Ah, yeah, see, I just need mm. more. I think we're good. Mm. Okay. Ready to stab it? Here you go, you start stabbing. Stab, nope, other end. Remember? Stab. Good. Gotta be a little more, a little more gentle with it, okay? So that, so it holds its shape. Push and lift. Push and lift. Okay, you do it. What are you doing? Hold this. Hold this right here. Okay. Perfect. Good job. All right, seeds are next. We'll do some brandy wine tomatoes. 
Okay. These are really small. Just like that. Okay, come here. Here you go. Put those in here. <laughs> sort of. Yeah, those are not here. You want to put them in your fingertips? Look. There you go. Here you go. Pick them up. Pick them up. Pick them up like this. Pick them up. Put them in. In the hole. Yeah. Pick them up. Yeah. If we end up with too many plants, we'll just donate them to somebody. Here you go. Pull those out. We can go to your school. They have a little garden, a little mini garden. Great job. Oh, so good. Now we're now we're doing something. We're seeing the holes now. And we know where they're supposed to go, huh? Okay. Because I don't think we need 12 brandy wine tomato plants, but you know. All right, let's put some dirt on top. Get some of this dirt, put it on top. Keep going. Keep going. Scoop it up. Go on top. What do you think? We'll call him B Wine Toms. Okay? Perfect. I love it. Okay. that up two hands let's set in there perfect Abigail and then we need a lid and a light Push. nice I'll add water later it's not a big deal huh Come are you are you quitting on me? Are you quit you are just quitting on me. Okay. Well you do more we don't need to do any more today. We can do more like in a week or so. Okay. I'm always really impressed with how quickly Abigail picks things up, you know, sometimes like the fine motor skills and stuff like that, um, are really what what holds her back and that's why you know it's so important like all these intervention type therapies like occupational therapy and stuff she does get occupational therapy but it's very very important to get those things because the fine motor skills are going straight in straight out holding the tool not flicking dirt out and all that you know she totally gets the concept of it um i don't know that she understands like what we're doing exactly but she will once they start growing which is pretty cool she's gonna recognize these containers and she'll see them inside the house you know on a daily basis so we're putting in uh these are roma tomatoes right now but all those all those therapies and early interventions they really do work together there's probably a tool for this right so they getting the seeds out of the package a little more strategically um, some kind of like the same thing they use in the pharmacy to separate pills, maybe. But all this stuff works together. And everything that we do, every little goofy little activity like this, just you know, where I'm, I have this wild hair where I'm like, hey, I gotta do this anyway. 
why don't you join me? It all helps build on that. Of course, to see major progress in this area, we would have to do this, you know, a few times a week for many weeks. And then she could literally do this on her own. But that's not a goal. It's just an extra activity to get her involved, get her doing something, and work on those skills as much as we can. I think I, think I love this setup, you guys. This is pretty great. I'm really excited to see these start going. I, did, I, I could just put them in the ground outside, you know, in a few weeks, or I could start them now and then move them outside as soon as the weather's nice and warm. Um, you know, 70, 80 degrees. I just like this idea better. It's like we get peppers and tomatoes sooner. So I'm stoked about this. This is, this is thrilling. A little, I will. I'll link this stuff in the video description. It's pretty cheap. Bromas. Yeah, I'll link it down below for you. Aspiring gardeners like myself. Or even, even as an activity for your kid. This, this is a pretty cool. Yeah, we will have extra plants for sure. I do not need two dozen tomato plants, but uh, like I said, Abby's, Abby's program has a little miniature garden, so we'll donate some of those once they're seedlings and they're easier to work with to them. There, we're going. We're going for socks. And et cetera. And no et cetera. There's no et cetera. You are not the boss. <laughs> I make my own money. Priscilla I got needs, my own card. Priscilla needs socks. I need socks. I have a pair of socks that I've discovered. But you're saying they're Isaiah's socks? Yeah. Don't tell him. Okay. Nobody tell him that I took his socks. He'll never know. <laughs> he will never know. That boy has so many socks. He has a ton of socks. How do you know they're his? You haven't even seen them. They're gray. They're all gray. They're all gray. There's our and they're super thin. I know exactly what socks you're talking about. They're the best socks ever. My feet don't feel like they're in a girdle. His socks end up with my socks all the time. Mm -hmm. Those are his socks. I know his socks. Well, they're amazing. We gotta find those socks. Okay. <laughs> this is a commitment. She's so stressed right now buying I'm socks. I'm a sock person. Why are you buying socks? To wear my old lady shoes. Why are you wearing old lady shoes? Because my feet are... <laughs> Don't wear hey dudes. <laughs> I'm sorry, hey dude, I love you. My feet do not love you. <laughs> so. Priscilla's so upset, she's gotta buy socks. Yeah. We live in Florida. Floridians should not own socks. <laughs> Those are gonna be good ones? You know, it says arch support, so right. cushion, like reinforced heel and toe. Smooth toe seams is a big deal. Ventilating mesh, <laughs> whatever that means. Well, howdy, stranger. How are you? Nice braids. Did you have fun hanging out with your friends? Hey, you, you did. That's good. That's good. We bought socks. That's all we bought. Nothing more. Nothing less. I'm sticking to it. Hey, do you want to help? Come help me switch laundry. That'd be awesome. A little One Direction on the television. All is well. It's another planter. That's for the herbs. That's where the herbs are gonna go. <laughs> Priscilla said I'm turning our house into a farm. <clears throat> but we're gonna have so many, so much fresh, fresh produce. You know, it's gonna be wonderful. She's gonna appreciate it. She does appreciate it. She just likes to pick on me because I like to pick on her. It's what we do. So if you don't watch the other channel, then you didn't see uh, the finished product. I realize that, my bad. So, here you go. Uh, this is what they look like in their little, little grow habitat in there. Got some condensation on the inside, good humidity going on. Um, I assembled them wrong, so just had to tell you that, so that you know, in case you get them. The little felt piece, it wicks water up to the dirt, so they're self-watering you know, dampen the soil and then they just, they just do their thing on their own. Fill them up with water and it wicks the water up. But 
I you know made sure I wanted to show you that. Speaking of like the OT type activities and stuff, this stuff is so good because gardening specifically, you know, the sensory aspect of it. Uh, later we get to plant those things, so we got to work on those fine motor skills of being very gentle with stuff. If you watch Abigail's progression through that, it's so cool to watch her progress from like the very first one into the second pot that quickly, you know. And like I said, this isn't like a, it's not like a job for her. We're not training her to to do this stuff. It's just. It's just these little life skills that we can implement throughout her day with normal everyday things that we're doing anyway. That's what, that's really what we focus on. You know, planting things isn't going to increase her independence specifically, but those individual actions, those tiny, you know, picking up those tiny little seeds like that, that's gonna help her develop those, those muscle skills and stuff. So anything that we can do to add to you know her daily tasks and what she's already learning i think is a bonus i mean there's no negative to it you know and then like i said she gets to watch this stuff grow and the, the whole process of it to eventually where she's picking stuff and bringing it into mom so mom can make her amazing salsa so many people just crapping on me for being so excited about tomatoes because i hate tomatoes you don't understand i love tomato based products salsa pasta sauce anything ketchup anything tomato just not tomatoes so get off me about the tomatoes they're the devil's fruit i don't know what to tell you they taste like crap they're horrible they're disgusting disgusting things and three-fourths of my family don't like fresh tomatoes so who's wrong who's wrong in this thanks for watching see you guys tomorrow